What's up guys, it's me Packy with the house and today we're using a six pound house ball against 50 pound rack of bowling pins. There's gonna be some serious deflection. Let's get to it. Oh, it's gonna be less than 100 if I do that. That's a makeable spare, I think. This is a guaranteed make, guaranteed. That almost missed it. That almost missed the three pin. This is a guaranteed make. <gasps> I thought it was a make the whole time. I'm just saying. So after a couple warm up shots and uh, frame one deflection, I think 100 is going to be a really good score. I don't know how I'm going to get there, but that's the goal. If I hit the pocket, my ball barely touches the two. I really needed that pin to fall. I feel like I could leave a back row on this where like my ball hits the pocket and it just doesn't make it off the deck. Keep that pre-shot routine the same. That was a big time spare for me. I knew if I didn't hit the six pin like dead on, I might shoot it in front of the 10. I almost, I almost hit. A different definition to a wrap 10. Huge shout out to Shocker Sports Grill and Lanes. I don't know any bowling alley that has pins like this. And two, I don't know any bowling alley or people like the people here at Wichita State and Shocker Sports Grill and Lanes that would actually allow us to do this. So huge shout out to them for letting us do this video. Did you see the ball take that seven out? <laughs> the ball literally just took the seven straight out. I'm immediately upping my estimate to 150. That's a good score. Eventually we're gonna make a video about this, but I feel like it would be easier to touch a pin and not knock it over and doing this. You might be able to hit it like decent and just have it wiggle at you. Hook. That's a tough one. That's tough. It's gonna be way less than 100 if I do it like that. Eesh. Well, the light pocket, four six is a tough one to handle. Four frames in with 54 though, that's not bad. I'll take that. I'll take that every time. You said it first, the light pocket hit. That ain't it. I know those pins aren't broken. I put them all in the rack, they're heavy. It feels like there's a lead block in the middle of them. My ball might've gone out. That might've been what happened. Let me go check. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Patience is not my thing. I think the bounce is over. I still don't think so. Am I gonna try? Yes. Oh, right, that was a good attempt. I actually think if I hit it more solid, it would bounce further across. On pace for 124 through five, 62 in the fifth. I'll take that every time. You know how the PBA Tour has like chasing 300? Yeah. This is chasing 100. Welcome to the house channel. Oh, that's money. Okay. I'll take that, I can make that spare, maybe. <laughs> yeah, if I hit the pocket, I'm not even talking high, I'm just talking the pocket. It's probably gonna split. Some crazy combos that I definitely can't make. Oh no. All right. That one was a miss. That was a miss off my hand. Back on chasing 150. And real quick break here, 90,000 subscriber giveaway. You're not gonna win balls like this. You're gonna win real bowling balls that actually hook if we get to 90,000 subscribers before December 1st, and we are definitely off pace. So we need your help. Click that subscribe button down below, and once we get there, we'll be giving away a ball every single day for the end of the year. So help us get there quicker, and we'll give away more bowling balls. I'm impressing myself so far. Oh, that's terrible. Oh. I'm impressing myself so far. That's so bad. That's so bad. The Brooklyn hit's definitely not in play. I was so worried about trying to get it to go high that it went. Brooklyn. What is that? I said I gotta make this normal and then that happens. Am I gonna strike this game? 
Probably not. That's aced. Oh my god. That 610 is haunting me. It's my third one of the game. Spare break's 100. I need some strikes to shoot 150. Though. The original goal was 100. Though. The original goal was 100. Spare break's 100. Wrap 10, that's tough. I needed to hit it thinner or heavier, not that. Spare broke 100 and I did. Not yet, not yet. A three bagger for 150? That's not gonna happen. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Three, four, six, seven, nine. Yeah, let me know if any of you guys have ever left that. Comment down below and let me know what the craziest split you've ever left is. Officially a 101, because I got more than four. Thank God. I feel like the bowling gods just ripped me of the best bear of my career. I need to fill 20 for 125. Oh my God. I can't strike. I can't strike. But I can spare this and then strike for 125 still. Frame five that I was gonna shoot 125? No, you were saying Well, okay, well, I probably said a lot of numbers. Thought that was a miss. That was definitely a miss. I can strike here for a buck 25. That's a respectable score, I think. I still can't believe that last one missed. I'm pissed. I'm gonna go ahead and say that nobody's ever done this before. Shot 120 on these pins with this ball. I'm gonna go ahead and say no one's ever played this game, which is why I'm the first one to do it. You could call me a world record holder. Somebody get me a contact at Guinness. Brilliant! 125 on the strike. Well, we went this game with Zero strikes. This game's impossible. All right, so uh, as we said in the beginning, there's gonna be some serious deflection and physics is undefeated. 123 here with a six pound ball, 50 pound pins. I am just gonna go ahead and call myself the world record holder at this game. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. And if you wanna see more videos like that, you can click right up here for more fun challenges that we do on the channel. All right, what's up guys? It's me, Packy, with the house, and today we're using six pound balls on a 50 pound rack, which means five pounds, one for each of the pins. I don't know how to speak English.